at once. Now we may speak with something like privacy. Tain has asked something of you. And you accepted. How terribly large-hearted of you. Forgive me my assumption, then. Word of your good deeds precedes you. What Tain asks of you appears a mercy, but it's only a selfish attempt to bolster his reputation. He's a devious child who delights in making the rest of us clean up his messes. A quality common to Archmages, it seems. I'd say I resent the comment, but you're not wrong. Many of the poor souls held captive here have been so for decades. Anyone they knew is likely dead, their old lives gone. To return them to the world with nothing is a cruelty. The gods only know what havoc these broken people will wreak with the information Tain intends to give them. Lay their souls to rest. Return them to the wheel. All things die. Death is the keystone of the natural order. It's no more extreme than birth. Another chance at life through death is a far greater mercy than relegation to suffering through a dull shade of the lives they once knew. Is it not mercy to let an abused soul move on to a better existence, one free of the memory of the suffering they survived here? You gotta talk around it that much. Maybe it ain't worth talking about. Hmm. And if it were you, Adele, or your brother, would you leave him here? This scroll will aid you. You need only read the incantation scribed upon it, preferably in a place where all may hear it. Their deaths will be swift and painless.